Hello everyone, a new puzzle, a wooden ball. I bought it from a company in China and it came in a padded envelope and then inside it's got this plastic wrapping and made of wood, pretty colours, pastel colours, very duck egg blue I think that's called and a pale pink and then natural wood colour. So looks pretty. Let's unbox it. So I use a pen knife to take to open the plastic wrapping. That just peels off. And there it is. Pretty good. Right, let's go about taking it apart. It feels very tightly connected. There's no play in the parts, no looseness. Okay, so what you do to take the puzzle apart, look for the two parts that are facing each other like that. Any two will do. Let's take these blue ones and pull them apart. And the other side. There, it clicked. Now I'll just carry on doing that. Let's try a pink pair. Pull them apart slightly. And let's try the natural wood colour pair. And it's getting looser and looser. And this one's quite tightly put together. So it needs to be pulled apart quite a lot. There, if you keep doing it and then at some point the puzzle goes. Whee! So the colours help to show that there are six pieces identical pieces okay let's put the puzzle back together so you take one piece it's got a pyramid in the middle and get it so the tips of the pyramids meet a different colored piece and another one in the top different color so you get that arrangement then you want pieces in the sides So that goes in there, one side, and let's do another piece this side, like so, and you've got a sort of well, little dip, and the last piece goes in there. You very loosely cup the ball in your hand so that it can come apart and manoeuvre the final piece in. It's slightly tricky, like that, and then just squeeze the pieces together. However, that works. I've got the ball again, but the pieces aren't the colours. If you've got some puzzles, they're all one colour, but this one's a bit tricky because it's got three colours. And the pieces aren't, you want the pink piece pieces opposite each other. So that takes a bit more work. So to get the colours properly opposite each other, take one piece, then the pieces that use the same colour for the top and bottom, the same colour. And again, the same colour for the sides. So blue on the left, blue on the right. Cut the ball loosely, the last piece in the middle, very carefully. There. And now you've got the pieces correctly opposite each other, correctly aligned. Lovely puzzle, very clever. 
Ta-da! Hope you enjoyed it. See you later. Yay.